Okay, good morning guys. It is bright and early on Monday morning. It's December 2nd, so this will be Vlogmas Day 3. And I just dropped my daughter off at school. So now I'm sitting like a creep in the parking lot of the grocery store because I don't want to go home and come back out. I just want to go to the grocery store now, you know what I'm saying? So it is 8.55 a.m. It opens at 9. So we're just going to hang out in the parking lot and wait until we can go inside. Hi guys, I'm back home now. I ran all my errands. I put on some makeup for the first time since I think Vlogmas has begun. And I'm getting ready to sit and film a video which will go up the day after you're seeing this one. So I think it'll be like Vlogmas day four and that's gonna be a paranormal video about some haunted castles in Victoria, British Columbia. So that'll be fun. And they're actually both owned by the same family. A lot of weird stuff happening in this family. Anyway, I've got a mug of coffee. It's just black coffee, but this mug says, I'm only a morning person on Christmas. And honestly, that's so true. <laughs> so I just thought I would pop in and say hi to you guys. I don't really have too much to tell you. After I'm done filming, I'm gonna sit down and finish writing some Christmas cards. I still don't have them in the mail. Normally they are in the mail by December 2nd. I normally get them in the mail the end of November, but November was just chaos this year with NaNoWriMo. Literally every spare minute I had, I was writing. So now I'm kind of trying to catch up on things I should have also been doing in November, but that didn't get done. So we're gonna do it. So we're gonna get those cards finished. I'd like to get them in the mail tomorrow, which is the third, but if not, definitely the fourth. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go film now, you guys. So I hope you're having a good day and I'll see you now in a second. <laughs> All right, hey guys, so I haven't printed it out yet, but this is what the NaNoWriMo certificate looks like. So pretty, it's got my name, the book's name, you just type those in yourself, and then the date, November 30th, Love that. Hey, hello, I have just come to sit and write to some Christmas cards. I just finished making a salad for dinner, and we're gonna have either steak or burgers or something to go with that. I'm just, look, look. I need to dye my hair again soon. <laughs> my roots, they come out the worst at the temples. Anyway, let's get some Christmas card writing done. So these are the ones I currently have done. A lot of these are for YouTubers. And by YouTubers, I just want to clarify that I mean you guys, my YouTube friends. This is the one I'm currently doing. This is for Elena. <laughs> Elena, if you're watching this, your card's getting written next. Anyway, so yeah, let's see how that goes. Okay, so I've got a good start on that. I've got, I'd say, probably 10 or 15 here. And then I've got some more down here on the floor that are finished. Another 10, I would say. So now I'm just, I'm watching some Vlogmas. Got the tree on. I still that. Look, look at this. That mop and bucket is still there. It's been there for, I think, two days now. So I need to get rid of that. But the tree is up. The Vlogmas is on. The cards are being written. The water is being consumed. All in all, it's a good, it's a good afternoon. All right, hi guys, it is nighttime now. Well, technically it's still evening time, it's only 6 p.m., but it feels like nighttime. In my soul it feels like nighttime because it's pitch blackout. And has been for roughly two and a half hours. So it feels like the middle of the night that, uh, it's funny because actually a couple weeks ago we went out to dinner with my sister and her husband and we came up with the fact that 8 p.m. is the equivalent of midnight in the winter time. So now whenever we're talking about anything that takes place in the nighttime, we always refer to 8 p.m. and after as winter midnight. So like for instance, I'm not leaving the house after winter midnight or it's fine to go to bed, it's past winter midnight. <laughs> anyway, um, so I, my allergies are really bad tonight. My nose is running, my eyes are running. 
I don't know what's going on. Anyway, uh, one thing that I did want to talk to you guys about tonight was the other night, my husband and I watched a movie. And it came on, it wasn't on Netflix or anything, I think it was on demand, like on our cable. But, um, it probably wouldn't be that difficult to find if you want to watch it. Anyway, it starred Dan Stevens from Downton Abbey fame. If you like Downton Abbey, he was Cousin Matthew. And uh, in it, he plays Charles Dickens. And the movie's called The Man Who Invented Christmas. And it's about Dickens and his struggles to get this book written. And there's a lot of stakes. It's high pressure. There's a lot going on. Even though, as you're watching it, you know. You know he gets it written. <laughs> You know it gets published because we've all read it or seen the movies, but even though you know that, it's still like high stakes stressful a little bit. Anyway, it was just fantastic. It was so good. And uh, to me, it's definitely something that will become a Christmas classic, I think. I think I'd reach for that more often than even an actual rendition of A Christmas Carol. Maybe. I loved it. So yeah, check that out if you can. See if it's on, it might be on American Netflix, who knows. But it was a Canadian movie. I keep looking at my husband because he's literally three feet away. <laughs> and normally he isn't. Normally when I'm filming like this, I'm filming alone, but now he's right there. So I keep looking at him as though he's gonna answer, but uh, he doesn't because I'm filming. <laughs> it, it's on Crave here in Canada. I don't it's know on if Crave that, in Canada. I don't know if it, I don't know what the heck it would be down in the states. I, I don't know, but yeah, Maybe who? it's on crazy. I don't know. We don't know. Yeah, it's it's on something. I bet iTunes probably has it. If that, if you rent movies from there, I think you can rent movies from YouTube nowadays. Yeah, there's you you can find it if you yes. really want to see it. You'll yes. find it somewhere. It was awesome though. It was very it was really good. <laughs> okay. Anyway, tomorrow we're gonna be doing some running around. I want to go into the crystal shop here in town because I follow them on Facebook and I saw that they posted a picture of a new crystal that they got in. And it's one that I've never heard of and never seen and they look beautiful. And this shop, they have really affordable prices for their single crystals. So I was going to go in, take a look, see what they got. It's been a while since I've been in there so I'll take you along there. I'll try to vlog in the shop. It's so gorgeous. I don't know if I'm brave enough for that because it's usually just you and the shop owner <laughs> standing in one big room. So I don't know how how brave I'll be to actually pull up my phone and start vlogging, but you never know. Also tomorrow I will be mailing those Christmas cards you saw me writing earlier today. Um, a bunch of them are going out to you guys and it's so fun. I've got one going to France. I've got one going to Spain. I've got one going to Mexico. I've got a bunch going to America and of course all around Canada. It's just so fun to get to see all the cards go all around the world to all of you awesome ladies that I've met. And uh, it's just a lot of fun. Anyway, I guess that's probably gonna do it for today, all in this vlog. And uh, we're still about two hours away from winter midnight, so it's not quite bedtime, but we're getting there. We're getting there and uh, I think hour we might minutes. an hour and fifty one minutes. minutes. <laughs> we're just counting down till bedtime. That's how you know you're old. Which <laughs> for eight p.m. bedtime. To our eight p.m. bedtime. And it's funny because normally I'm such a night owl, but like once daylight savings comes, it's like it's a struggle to make it to eight p.m. Also, speaking of you know you're old, when I saw on Twitter today and it made me laugh and it said, when I was a kid, I used to think an adult drink was coffee. When I was a teenager, I used to think an adult drink was alcohol, but now that I'm an adult, I know that it's water. <laughs> and that just made me laugh. <laughs> okay, you guys, well, I hope you had a fantastic day and enjoyed this vlog. And I hope your December is off to a magical start. If you're someone who is having a tough time this December or struggling with, I know some of you guys have had sad losses or just going through tough times, just know that you're not alone and we're all here together. And if anyone ever needs an ear, I mean, you can find me on Instagram or Facebook. I'm always around if you need someone to talk to. 
Anyway, you guys, I will see you bright and early tomorrow morning. Bye.